happy Tuesday. Hope your day is going grand. Grand rising to some, good afternoon to others, and good evening to others. Today we're dealing with past mistakes. How some people keep dwelling on how you made a mistake a minute ago, two hours ago, 50 minutes ago, 50 months ago. They always bring up your past mistakes. In the word of God, in 2 Corinthians 5 and 17, it says, let us read. The verse says that anyone who belongs to Christ has become a new person, a new creature, that their old life is gone. Everything they used to do, even to the very second, I said second, everything before that, old, that was not good, is the past. Next word, Isaiah 43, 18, it says, the verse says that God commands people to forget the former things and not dwell on the past. So in life, it's basically saying, forget what you did in the past. Do what is godly and going forth. Once you have repented and asked for forgiveness, not only to God, but to that individual, to that community, whatever you've done that wasn't pleasing to God, move forward and that past is gone. It no longer exists. It is no longer in your eyes view. Amen. So what, what I'm trying to say is when people try to bring up your past, just basically say, cast the first stone, cast the first stone. I'm going to make mistakes. We're going to make mistakes. We're going to do things wrong. We're going to Say the wrong things. We're going to react in a wrong manner. We're going to walk ungodly sometimes. And it's it's wrong. It's wrong to act ungodly. But once we get in the word and stay in the word, we can t- continue to walk upright before God and before man. We're not here to please people here. Because there, if we stay in a state of pleasing people, human beings will never grow because we're going to always worry about what they think, what, how they react, how they think about us, whether they like us or not. If we, as the word God says, second Corinthians five and 17, it says that anyone who belongs to Christ has become a new person, has become a new individual, and that their old life is gone, has passed away. Hope that encourages you. Keep pressing forward. If someone keeps bringing up the past mistakes you've made, you may not need to be around that person or those people. Use your discernment. Have a great Tuesday. Hope your day has been swell. Peace.